What is going on, people? Welcome. Johnny here, and we are playing some RimWorld. We got Lark here, who is going to try to establish a sweet caravan and get one million gold pieces, which he's going to store in vaults throughout the map. And there might be a chance we have to abandon some of the bases where the vaults are. And if that's the case, I will have to keep like a paper log or something that says latitude and longitude and how much gold we left. Sadly, we're not good on social skills, which is a bit of an issue. But it is what it is. Does it say my skill level? Oh, okay, it does. It says my passions and whatnot. So, basic. Eh. Warden's going to be important. Handle's going to be less important. We'll leave bed rest low, but not top priority. Cooking's going to be somewhat important. Constructing is going to be important. Growing will be at some point. Mining at some point. Plant cutting at some point. I think constructing is going to be very important for now. Plant cutting is going to be very important for now. We're going to turn art off. Crafting will be important. Hall clean. Research will turn off as well. Now, it seems like our best play is going to be to hole up up in this area over here. Um... Now, people can come through this way, which just is what it is at this point. So I think we'll start by cutting down a few trees. This is some kind of marshy soil that we can't do anything with. But that's okay for now. So, what do we have? Steel? We have steel nearby. Plenty of it. There's even a building we can rip down. We could make this our home, or we could make this one our home. And I'm liking this one better. There's no overhead mountain there. But really all we got to do is build one door and then we can figure out the food situation after that, which shouldn't be too bad. So if we pop a few of these trees that are further along, we'll get that set up. And then we're going to need a zone as well. Nothing like the beginning of a new RimWorld game, man. I do enjoy it. <clears throat> For research... The vault will have to research before we can actually make one, but it is what it is. Don't want to make it too easy on us here. This cat could be a real problem. We're going to need some weaponry. It will be nice to be able to practice with that weaponry, but I guess for now that's not going to be the case. There are some berries about, so we'll be able to make some food out of that earlier on. So I think for now we'll let them get to the business of chopping up some trees and as soon as he does that make a door boom so between those two you should be able to get a door going this is at 60% yeah that guy's looking good I was gonna do some hauling I think we'll harvest this too in case he's hungry you can have, have a little feed alright we got a fair amount of food out of that so we're going to want a bow sooner rather than later. It's going to be dark in here. But if we put it outside, we're going to get a penalty. So can you make a bow? Looks like you can. Fantastic. And we'll also see if we can get some travel wear going as well. That's going to be it for now. All right, he's going to make the bow next, which is good. Why don't you just haul all that, sir? Gonna need light. Gonna need a bed. Mm, I guess we can take a stab at a bed as well. Which means we're gonna need a few more... ...bits of wood. Well, let's let him make that bow first. Not terribly exciting, but let's see. Bump him. We can look at the back of his head while he does it. I could have turned him around, I guess, but... All right. Oh, it turned out good. Fantastic. Now, I'm going to chop a few more trees so we have some materials. This guy looks... Some of these big teak trees. That last one made a fair amount, so we'll see if we can get some luck with that again. Make him haul it all so he doesn't... Oh, good, he did. I'm not sure how much we got out of that. Oh, beautiful. Awful. Oh, well. At least he has a bed. We'll worry about that later. So I think we're going to take care of some of the like super basics early on. Let's get him a table. 
It's probably a bad spot. Uh, let's go there with it. And I guess we can do that. How are we doing for construction three? He's a great crafter, though. So we're going to need some more wood for that. He hasn't eaten the berries yet. Oh, he is hungry, though. So let's find some more berries over this direction. And he wants to chop some trees, which is just fine. Hopefully this cat doesn't get feisty with us. Alright, boom, what do we got? An awful stool. <laughs> Alright, good, he's going to grab the berries. He might just eat them right away if he's hungry enough. There you go, see, indeed. There, that'll give us some berries, and then we just need some wood for a table. Let's take the ones that are more mature. And then after that, I think we'll... Well, harvest a few more berries so we have a few days worth of food. And then from there, why don't you haul all that, partner? There you go. Oh, he walked right by it. What a jerk. There you go. It's about to break. Not sure why. Recreation, food, rest, <laughs> you name it, he's about to break. <laughs> He's got all the reasons. How's his bed? Let's make sure we do some cleaning when you're done with this. Maybe we can... It's an awful bedroom, but this... It's mediocre. Alright, let's check his needs. So he's hot, he's naked, and he's hungry. It is 90-something degrees. So I think when he wakes up, we'll see if we can kill something. Maybe there's some alpacas. Yeah. Those guys are usually a decent play. And then... Gonna need some more wood on hand as well. He's got some berries, so he should be able to... Eh, let's not take that tree. I want some more mature ones. Sadly, we're running out of those, but we'll make a fire. We could probably put... He's probably got a darkness penalty here. Slept in the heat, ate without a table. He's an optimist. <laughs> He's got the initial optimism. I don't know why he didn't eat. Let's see if he'll... There you go. We don't want to get malnourished this early. Sweaty, naked. Yeah, we can take care of naked, so... There are some berries still set for harvesting. There's some more. We could pick on the turtle. It's never going to catch us. We have the wood. We can make a passive cooler in there, so maybe we do that. Visitors have already arrived. That's nice. So let's put this in the back corner. We'll just let them come to us. We're not going to go chasing them down. There we go. Alright, that should help with the temperature and the slept in the heat. So he'll nab some berries for them. Do they have anything to trade? Oh, there's a lot of people. Look at them all. Yeah, they do have stuff to trade, but we don't really have any harvest botched. Let's try that again. Four. Come on. Not, ooh, buddy. He is not good at this. We're going to have to get him shooting that bow here because I'd really like him to be able to shoot it when he needs to. And then when you get that stuff hauled in, come over here. Can't even catch her. Talk to her and see if she has anything for you. I'm having health issues. We should check on that. Yeah, there's nothing for us here, so cancel that. It's got heat stroke. It is going down, especially because he's in the cool air now. Sadly, not going to be any camels about. So we'll just let the heat stroke wear off. What's the temp inside? 70 beautiful degrees. That's nice. When you're done with this, you can clean and then you can dismiss the trader. It's, I'm only doing that because they're coming around in our place. So he doesn't have anything else to do. So, it does have heat stroke. It is increasing. So let's pick on these alpaca. Hopefully they don't... We're going to need a butcher spot at some point. Let's check his bio. This is going to take a while. 
He'll actually beat a three before too long here. He nabbed at that time. Beautiful. Alright, finish that guy off. Now, we need to set up the butcher spot and all that. And then we'll need a campfire and blah, blah, blah. So production, butcher spot. I'm going to do this inside, even though it's messy. So for now, we'll say do forever. Let's, we need some light in here. So let's do a torch lamp. I guess that can go. Now the business spot for that is there, so let's not put it there. I guess that can go there. All right, where's he at? Consuming berries. Can I get you to haul this little dude? There you go. All right, needs. Food, super low. We're gonna need a campfire if we're gonna cook these dudes. So temperature, campfire. There you go. And we'll make up some meals out of that guy. We should be able to kill enough of those alpaca to... Oh great, the heat wave is on. <laughs> that is not good. Alright, well he's asleep, so I'm going to cut out till he wakes up. Alright, he's back. Set this up for some simple meals. We'll just do it forever. Oh, he's burning his only leather. That's not great. Hope he doesn't get himself sick. Let's do some cleaning. Unhappy nudity. Yeah, we'll have to... I think we need 60 tribal wear. Let's see. Indeed, 60. So we need like four more of them bad boys. Alright. Health. No heat stroke, so that's good. Let's get him over here. Could have went after the pigs or the monkeys, but I think the alpaca are a pretty safe bet. They're not going to try and kill us. Come on, buddy, get it. The hell is that? A bunch of pigs running. They must have got accidentally shot. Or they just were scared off. The rhino are fleeing. Oh, it's the heat wave. So all of our animals are going to leave the boar because of the heat wave. Which isn't cool. Hopefully the alpaca can hang out. It's going to be a bit of... Alright, good. Finish that guy off. Alright, now. Consuming a simple meal. Bring that back with you. Health. What's the temperature? They're good till 113. Oh shite, it's 130 here. That's pretty rough. Do need some security of some sort. And we do have to bring down two more of these things too. I guess we'll let them cook just for the experience. I'd rather have them shooting in all honesty, but... How are these going to last? Four days. That's good. When you're done with that, partner, need some cleaning. Be nice if this heat wave ended. Are those guys leave yet? Oh, no. Yeah, it looks like the alpaca have fled the map as well. We got these stupid birds. I think ostrich make a different type of leather. Everything else skinned out. There's some cobras down there. There's a dead chinchilla. Uh-oh. <laughs> I don't think we're going to get any luck with the monkeys. Well, that's not great. Oh, look at this. We can allow that. And then he should butcher it up. Let's see what kind of leather they make. Well, so we have camel hide. What the hell? We didn't kill camels. Bird skin. Well, I guess we can kill a bunch of birds. We need to kill six more birds. When you're done with that, do some cleaning. Alright, so what's your needs? You might want to go to bed soon. I think he does. We're not going to go mess with that guy. He'll run off and kill something else. I want you to clean, not butcher. There you go. Dude, look out for that cat. Alright, good, so he's asleep. Oh, the cat's injured. No immediate danger. Let's take a shot at it. Inside, inside. Close the door, close the door. Yeah, buddy. 
Do some repairs. Something just blew up somewhere. Oh, we got a meteorite. Panther Revenge. And it's sandstone. Holy crap. Right there. Hopefully he can keep up with his panther. Alright, good. It's a maddened manhunter. So you just go to bed. Let that panther sleep it off. I'm going to forbid this door. Maybe it'll die on its own now. Yeah, buddy. Look at that death in 11 hours. Alright. Well, he's asleep. We're safe for the minute. Well, the panther did go down. So I am going to allow that door. Death in 5 hours. Extreme blood loss. I'd say he's ours. <laughs> Camel hide. Alright. Finish that guy off. I do some butchering. Really wants to clean. So we got 25 Panthera fur. Oh, nice. Cargo pods. Mmm. We'll get it, but... I don't just, well, that would be something we can make some cash off of, so that's good. There's a lot of these birds around, but I think they get pissed off at you, too. So for the minute, I think we're going to let them be. We need to get clothes, though. That's got to be our next... We also need some wood. Let's do some wood. No, that's 71. That'll be alright. This is ready to harvest. That one's 99. So that'll get us some of that. And then I think we'll go try and kill some birds after we get this wood hauled in. Because our fire and our torch require wood. Did not get a lot. So the bamboo trees, not what they should be. You know what we can do? We can actually make something for recreation. We should probably do that. So if we put it there, make him clean before he goes out and works on that. I think we should take down another tree or two as well. What do we have? Should be getting a raid any minute here. I want him to build that before I start chopping other trees down. There we go. It's not going to hurt. We might get stuck in inside. And you can do some cleaning. There you go. Alright, so I think we'll go kill a bird now. Well, now he started cooking. <laughs> These meals are all going to go bad anyways. So, clean that. Come with me. Bird, right there. How fast are these birds before we start messing with them? 4.6. What's our boy? He should be about that. 4.37. So don't get too close. Oh. Maybe we step out a bit. Hide behind this tree. It'll never see you there. Nope. It suddenly realized it was being hunted. God, he's not very... Nah, that's too close, partner. We're gonna end up getting attacked by this damn bird. There it is. Back inside. Death in 8 hours. Any weakened its movement. What's its current movement? 4.19. Good. So we are faster than it. There's a, why is it gaining on us? What is going on? Maybe we just keep running? Oh god. Will we ever get away? Alright. So we are all of a sudden 3.5. Due to the heat stroke. Jack it up, man. Hit it. No, jack it up. Pow. <laughs> oh, God, we're getting loaded. He's lighting us up, man. All right. Now we're going to be like... <laughs> no, now we have death. Oh, God, we're so bad at this. Oh, nice. All right, is there any medicine around? Probably should have looked into that before we went and did something dumb. I didn't see any the whole time I've been looking around. Alright, well I guess we'll allow him to self-tend. And then we'll make that guy haulable. Whew, that was rough. Certainly, So, mental note, if you mess with the birds, you get the beak, man. That was rough. Oh god. 11%. That could definitely be worse. Well, we're not going to mess with those birds, at least until we're fully healed again. 
What's he got? Bites and scratches, so it could be worse. Ooh, 0%. <laughs> Yikes. 21%, that's decent. Major break risk, we're going to lose him here. He's hungry. This will help his mood a little bit as he eats, I hope. Come on, there we go. All right. Let's just get that guy brought back up here. We'll let him go to bed when he gets back. He's pretty tired. All that running away from a bird really wears a guy out. All right. You can just do what you want. All right. Well, that was rough. We're going to let him sleep it off. Hey, good. The heat wave's over. We have alpaca meat rotting away. I'm going to have him clean before he starts butchering. Now he wants to go play horseshoes. We should probably allow that, given his mental state. <laughs> yeah, that helps. There you go. Look at that. Serious pain. Yikes. Yeah, that was that was rough. We need to get him some clothes, man. How are those lasting? 2.2 days and 2.9 days. At some point he's going to get food poisoning, and then it's all going to be over. <laughs> there you go. So that should give us 10 more. Oh, we got 13 that time. Alright, get this stuff hauled. Do a bunch of cleaning. We're going to expand this zone a little bit. And for now, that should be good. I don't want to take him out hunting until he recovers from this crap. Because he really got beat up there. We could take some of that drug. That'll, if he gets in a really bad state of mind again, that'll take his pain away. So far, let's see. How are we healing? 2.3... 5.9. Yeah, it's going to be a while. Ooh, man. It's rough. Very rough. Alright, looks like he's just bed resting because he doesn't have anything else to do. So I'm just going to let that happen. I'm hoping he doesn't get a permanent scar here. It's kind of early for that. That one's about to heal. Panther meat's rotting away. That's just fine. That one's going to heal fully in a minute as well. It's going pain. Oh, yep, look at that. So far, so good. There's a turtle. We could, Man, the, the turtle, at least they can't catch you. I got, we have to be severely 3.73 for movement now. Starvation. Well, buddy. Maybe do a little cleaning. Malnutrition. Ah, jeez. Torso is almost healed. Bandage quality 2%. Hopefully the bed rest helps. These do heal extremely slow, man. 3.9.1, so this will go away any minute. Come on, you can do it. 0 0.9, 1.1. 1 .1. Well, what else can we have him accomplish here? We can start pulling steel in. There's some components here as well. That's what I'm... I'm a little nervous about getting a permanent injury here. We can take this apart. How about we do that? Uh, let's see. Deconstruct. That'll get us some steel. And then we can have a zone just outside somewhere. So we'll make it preferred. And we'll put steel. That way it's not taking up our homestead. And then there's floors we want to remove. He did go up a level on the shooting, so that's good. Alright, how are we doing? 1.9. Oh, good. One left. Beautiful. 1.7 now. What can we do for power? We can do wind turbines, and we are on the beach, so that's not going to be a bad play. We don't have batteries, so that's going to be kind of a frustrating situation, but he's had enough for the day. Health. Oh, beautiful. He's fully healed. Well, he's asleep. When he wakes up, we'll come back. All right, he's back. We do have some alpaca back on the board. So I think we're going to run out of these food. They're just going to spoil soon. But that's okay. 
We'll let him finish this steel job, I guess, so something actually happens. And then we'll go over there and nab those alpaca. Come on, you can get it all, buddy. No, nope, not going to happen. So we can just get him the priority all that back as well. Okay, so once he's done with this, needs... What's he going to do? He's going to refuel the fire. Forget that. Let's, uh... There they are. Our victims. Our peaceful, happy-to-die victims. We need some medicine, man. Can we plant anything? Yeah, we should start planting as well, because we need to get our planting skill up. Alright, so go there and start blasting that, dude. I don't know why it's giving us camel hide. That's a little weird. Alright, let's check his bio. It's going to be a while before he hits level 4, though. He's certainly not the best shot. If we get attacked, which we will. Hey, we hit the wrong one. Not a bad thing, necessarily. Thank God these things don't snap on you. Like, hunting is an all-day job around here. Point blank range. Nailed it. Alright, so. Unforbid. Playing horseshoes. Let's get him to bring it over here, at least. Could allow corpses here, but I don't want to do that yet. It's still pretty stinking warm, too. Uh, we ran out of wood in here, so it's warm in there as well. Yikes. Alright, you can go do what you want, buddy. Bird meat's rotting away. Should lose a bunch of our meals. We're going to need another tree chopped down. How's that? Ready to harvest. Beautiful. Those ones make a lot of wood as well. There's two of them. Perfect. Alright, guys, going to get some food in him. Chop those two trees down. Should refuel the items that require it in his home there. Hopefully. Hopefully this first. Let's get that taken care of. And then we're also do some cleaning. There you go. Alright, another night. And the temperature is nice. Let's check his needs. Unsightly, awful. That's because we have a dead body and a bunch of other stuff laying around. And he's getting heat stroke again. Jeez. Alright, well we had meals rot away, but we did have some spacecraft chunks fall, which is a lot of components so that's gonna be great it's gonna go chop down that other tree we should really get some security it wouldn't be too hard could pro if they come in down here they're gonna come this way but if they come in anywhere else they're gonna come through here so we could close that off we could do it temporarily with wood I just wanna get some clothes here first low food yeah you're telling me partner all right, it better be camel hide. So what do we have? We have 55, we have to take one more alpaca down. And then we can actually make the clothes. So let's get to that. That'll be a good wrap up. Ooh, look at this. There's, we should have took that building. Completely intact. Probably not an ancient danger, but maybe. It's kind of small. Nailed it. It's never gonna hit it over these rocks. Oh, he did. Let's see if it's an ancient danger. No, it is not. Beautiful. Awesome. Alright, so let's get that set to that and that set to that. Let's do that and then he should bring it back with him. Oh, there's nowhere to put it. Yeah. We'll just get him to bring it over. Ooh, more cargo pods. You don't say. Oh, plasteel. Beautiful. So we're looking for wealth, man. That's going to be the goal. One million silver. That's no small amount of silver. Simple meals rotted away. Needs. Here, let's follow him. Bam. These mods are great because you can like, whoa. And you can zoom way out. All right, now we have Plasteel. All right, good. He's making some clothes. Let's get him to clean. Let's get him to clean now. There you go. So let's check our wealth. We're starting to get up there already. What's the green line? Buildings. Oh, we never claimed this. I do want it to get repaired, so let's do that. 
there. There's some more food. Well, why didn't you put on the clothes, dude? There he is. Good. So that takes care of the nudity. And he's going to do some cooking. So I think our next goal then is to get some security in place. We have steel we could do it out of. But I think we'll start with just simple wood. If we do wood with wooden traps, that should work out just fine. So when you're done chilling, make sure you clean before you go to bed. And we have tons of wood laying around already. So that'll be our next goal here. Needs. All right. Well, that's going to be it for this episode. So thanks for tuning in. So far, we've accumulated zero silver. <laughs> but we're still alive despite the bloodbath going on out here. So next time, I think we'll get some security going across here. And I think we will see what we can do about blocking. Like, all we have to do is bridge and build a little wall over there. Now, if people come in over here, hopefully then they path around them through the other side. We are going to end up mining this out, so we'll have to do some block walls in here. Maybe we can just build the base over here, but I do need to get some planting going as well. So, if you're enjoying this, do me a favor, hit the like button. If you want to see how this is going to go, play along. I'm not sure we can actually get a million silver, but we're definitely going to try. And yeah, we'll build some awesome little vaults. That should be fun. If you want to play along, check out the link in the description. You can see where you can download the save file, the initial start file. And you'll have to set your mods up the same, but I show that during the episode zero opening. So I'll see you guys next time.